City of Franklin Police Department is preparing to lay K-9 officer Fury to rest on Thursday. The Highway Patrol says a car driving the wrong way through Franklin hit a marked cruiser, killing that K-9 and sending two other officers in that car to the hospital. So today, the suspect facing charges in connection to the crash appeared in court. Ken Brown was inside the courtroom for that arraignment. The chief of police here in Franklin and about half a dozen other officers were in the Franklin Municipal Courtroom this morning, but so was the fiance of Michael Sims, the suspect in this case, and she spoke with us ahead of his arraignment. I just wanted to say that the, uh, like me trying to hit the police officer, uh, that was, it wasn't intentional. I wasn't intending to hurt him. Right. I wasn't intending to Mr. hurt Mr. Sims, I'm, I'm going to stop you there a little bit. That's the extent of what we heard from Michael Sims in court. He's the man accused of intentionally driving the wrong way on a one way street and slamming into a police cruiser, injuring two officers and killing a police canine. Sims's fiance says he's schizophrenic and was without his medication as they were in the middle of a move. I was on the phone with him 18 minutes before the accident happened. And that whole time he kept asking me, are you alive? Are you really there? Are you in your body? Just stuff that you wouldn't you wouldn't you wouldn't find normal if you would have pulled over that day and called um, 911 those two officers would have uh, did went above and beyond to take care of him and make sure he wasn't going to hurt himself or anyone else it was unnecessary and um, preventable and caused by him and, and no one else Sims's fiance says she called a non-emergency police line in Oxford and alerted them to the situation before the crash happened because she realized he was having an issue in court, the prosecution said Sims sped up to 70 miles per hour in a 25 mile per hour street. He intentionally swerved into officers and that data from his car shows he stayed on the accelerator the whole time. Now we have newly released body cam footage of the aftermath of this crash. Ace down! Put your hands behind your back! Sims now has a preliminary hearing set for a week from today. Reporting in Franklin, Ken Brown, Fox 19.